hello everyone it's me asmr welcoming you to my new logo design tutorial and today i'll show you this type of shield type logo design in illustrator and after uh, making the ai file we just made it uh, in a psd which is the mock-up so let's start the tutorial if you're new in my channel please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications at first going to the illustrator and uh, i just made this one over here okay going to the file and taking new options taking the pixels you can take it inch but i'm taking here rgb there so i'm getting here the pixel 2000 pixel by 2000 pixel and here the logo or shield logo or game logo whatever you can tell and hit the create button you'll get the blank artboard after that we'll make the shield shape how to use that or how to make that by using the ellipse tool here is the ellipse tool press shift and hold it make a circle like that from here turning off the fill color and then press the option and alter button uh, if you are user of the mac or um, uh, if you are user of the windows press the alter button and if you are user of the mac you will press option button to copy for like that press the shift and hold it you are getting the proper alignment of these circles okay after that select all the steps here is shape builders tool which is really helpful for us and uh, you can press the alter option button and remove all the steps from here and then you are getting the shield shape okay we'll use it later okay deleting another one okay going to the line tool press shift and hold it and drawing line like this press the alter option button from the keyboard and press the shift and hold it at a time yeah you are getting the copy like that press ctrl or command d you can make um, uh, 12 lines 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 making it group after making that group making it bigger and align into the middle of the artboard that's good and press ctrl c and ctrl f and rotate this one that's good that's fine and now i'm taking this one into middle of the artboard okay that's fine and now i'll make it bigger i'll make it bigger according to the lines outer lines select this one this shield ctrl c and ctrl f making it a little bit smaller yeah now again going to the shape builders tool and turning off the stroke giving the fill color any kind of color fill color okay now you can work with that our shape is ready be careful when you are doing uh, making the shape if any portion left please do select all the stuffs and after that again going to the magic wand tool and select the lines and delete at a time okay our logo is almost ready turning off the stroke from here and press a from the keyboard or select here the direct selection tool and select once and making it a little bit bigger yeah press the shift and the up arrow key okay and select this one that means this line only copy this one press the shift and rotate this one and place over here into middle that's good now press the direct selection tool select this and press the shift and making it more smaller like this and select these two lines select properly actually this should be here into this okay that's fine if you want you can make it uh, bigger than this that means this portion if you want okay now select these things and making it group and already downloaded some mockups uh, from freepeak.com here this one logo mockup this so this mockup i'll provide you in my video description that means the la link of the download okay this mockup here is the smart object turning off this one press ctrl command v 
and making it a little bit smaller according to this set it into middle of the artboard and saving in this window and you're getting the result in this window actually so you're getting the logo which is really cool and hope that you learn a lot from this video until the next video i may say i'm signing out stay safe stay at home if you have any kind of question query please do comment on my video comment section bye bye